Hello, I am Professor Sanjay Varma from Information Systems area at IIM Ahmedabad. I have been teaching courses related to information systems such as management information systems, strategic management of information technology, knowledge management, customer relationship management, etc. here at IIM Ahmedabad for around two decades. Today, I present to you an executive development program titled Strategic IT Management for CIOs. We have been offering this program for around 12 years now. The first question that comes to mind is why such a program? After talking to many executives from industry, we realized that many times people who lead information technology, they either come from technology background and do not have any inputs in management of technology or on other hand we have people heading information technology group or departments who come from management background and do not have any leads or any knowledge in, of information technology therefore people from one domain or one discipline are trying to work into a multidisciplinary area in such cases there are many often times issues where people don't understand what direction should information technology take in the organization. To bridge this gap, we brought this program which has been conceived here keeping in mind the two sets of people. First, who come from technology background or and second, who come from management background. Now I bring to you the kind of topics that we cover in this program and you will realize what is the focus of this program. Some of the topics that we will cover in this program are such as understanding why IT initiatives fail. Now quite often we say that a particular IT project has failed and quite often we may ascribe the failure to technology but more often that than not the IT implementation project fails not because of technology but because of managerial limitations. What are the factors that cause the failure and what are the symptoms of such failures and is it possible for us to identify or to forecast in much advance that this project is likely to fail. If we can forecast that this project is likely to fail or that it will go over budget or over schedule then we may take proactive measures such that the project is, is completed in budget or in schedule. Quite often when we develop information systems the objective is to take care of information requirements of managers but what we fail to understand is that this information system project that we are undertaking has connections or relationships with other systems in the organization which may include the HR system for example performance management system or business strategy of the organization or marketing strategy of the organization and so on and so forth. The information system doesn't exist in its individuality. It works, it coexists with other systems also. The course discusses such kind of relationships with other systems also. When we talk of information system strategy, quite often the information system strategy draws from business strategy of the organization. How do you understand business strategy? What kind of strategy becomes important in what situation? And how do we draw information system strategy from business strategy? Therefore, it is very important for us to understand business strategy and that's also discussed in this program. Further, when we have information systems department or organization, quite often we make it as a monolithic organization. But actually, depending on the type of organization, the kind of role that is given to IT functionaries, we have to understand that the departmentalization or its structure may require a change. Therefore, what are the different kind of structures possible for IT and when, in what situations, what kind of structure will be apt, that's what we'll learn in this program. 
Further, we'll also learn the latest technologies that are coming up and what are the challenges we face when we are implementing these technologies in the organization and therefore how at different phases based on innovation life cycle, what kind of initiative should be taken such that the initiative, the IT application implementation becomes as successful as possible in shortest possible time. Therefore, overall, as you can see, the program is focusing on the managing aspect of technology and people and finances and strategy, everything in an organization. It sees information technology and systems as a focal point and where everything else in the organization revolves around information technology strategy. So I encourage you to visit our website, download the brochure and see the contents. So I hope we'll meet very soon at the campus. Thank you for considering this program.